Have you ever been searching for a fault in the engine management system and needed another opinion or extra information to assist you with your diagnostic process? Have you fully explored what onboard diagnostics can provide? Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Automate. When breaking down the SAE and ISO standards that form the framework for OBD2, or the equivalent European standard, we can identify the key elements that are important to understand when approaching diagnostics. We will be exploring several elements in more detail and looking at how this information is accessed and displayed using a scan tool on an OBD2 or EOBD compliant vehicle. Depending on the scan tool used, We'll determine how this OBD information is displayed, but in essence, the generic OBD program will cover multiple software modes. The generic OBD program is a dedicated program when compared to the vehicle-specific software selection. The key elements that we will be focusing on include the display and structure of fault codes, fault recording via freeze-frame data, monitors and criteria for components and system faults, vehicle drive cycle framework, driver fault notification, vehicle emission levels, components and system information terminology, and access to service information and calibrations. Let's take a closer look at these particular key elements. Fault code structure is clearly defined under OBD2 which is in accordance with the SAE standards. There is scope within these standards for manufacturers to develop their own specific codes, although these must follow the same structure as the generic SAE defined codes. Using generic OBD scan tool software, when we navigate to mode three, seven or 10, we are presented with a list of diagnostic trouble codes. To find out more and access the most advanced automotive technical training available, visit our website and unlock your automotive potential today.